Setting up report filters in Lot Wizard Pro. We're going to start with the inventory list. Once there, you'll notice at the bottom of the page you have the quick filter selections. The first thing you can do is you can choose a model year. You can also do a range. You can choose the particular make. You could choose the model if you want, or you could just leave it for that make in that year range. You can choose sold only sold and current or current as of. In this case we're using current as of. Choose whether it's new or used. Choose the vehicle type. You could even choose this to separate it by selling prices or options or whether it's a stock or consignment item or a date range depending on whether or not you were looking for units that were purchased between certain dates. You would then click apply filter which will bring up the vehicles you're looking for. Once this is done you could click save and you could click in here and type in what you want to name this filter. In this case we're going to say Audi 01206. Hit OK. And that filter is now saved here in your saved filters area. If you click on the drop down you can then choose that filter and run it again at any given point in time. It's that simple to set up a filter. If you have any questions feel free to contact us. Have a great day.